Hello, my name is Scuffer SP Gaming. We're here in American Truck Simulator. I've been waiting for this for quite a while, and uh, it's been a while since I played Euro Truck Simulator 2, but uh, I'm in here. From what I understand, this game is pretty much identical to Euro Truck 2, except, of course, it takes place in America. So, with that said, most of what we know from the previous Euro Truck should apply to this one. It's just, you know, different details and things like that. Anyway, we are going to create a new profile. And I will just say one of the annoying things about this game is that this is what you see when you load up the game for the first time. And there is no options. Nowhere to change the music level, volume levels, the graphics quality, things like that. No, you don't have that option. It is specific to a profile. So as soon as I create this profile, what's going to happen, because I've already gone through this process, to drop the volume in the game, is that the music you won't hear in the video because I have reduced the volume in editing. So yeah, it's going to be a little bit annoying for me. Anyway, we have our name. This is our name. I'm going to go with SB Gaming because you know, that's, yeah, anyway. <laughs> we can either go with a female character or male character. I think that's what it is. Um, yep, that's male. This is female. And from what I understand, all these pictures are the exact same from Euro Truck Simulator 2. So I'm going to go with that one because that was the picture that we had in our Euro Truck Simulator 2 series. Preferred truck design, we have Kenworth and we have Peterbilt. I don't know the difference between the two vehicles. They look otherwise identical to me. Maybe a little bit here on the front bumper. Um, the cab here sticks out a little bit more than this one. The front grills are a little bit different. Uh, this one has a central column there. This has like three. Uh, but otherwise, I have no idea how the trucks perform, so it's pretty much pick whichever one you like. And yeah, I'll go with the Peterbilt. Anyway, company logo, I'd like to know if it's possible to import your own custom logo because these eight options are kind of disappointing. Anyway, I think I'm going to go with this one just because. And we are going to call ourselves SB Gaming transport for reasons language English playing module California of course that includes Nevada Arizona will be coming for a free update when it's finished anyway let's create this profile keyboard drive using the keyboard and look around the world yep and I'm going to go with simple automatic real automatic uh, idea for real Pedals, manual shift gears up and down. I don't know gears. I just want to drive. Simple automatic is good enough for me. I'm gonna finish the wizard. Select the city you want to start in. Well, what I would like to do is find a city that is relatively central. Um, let's see, whereas it is. Say it's about between the north and the south, and it's about the same distance to Elko, more or less. Of course, there's probably not a road that goes straight down, so yeah, it is what it is, but uh, it's relatively central. So I'm gonna go with California. You wanna walk through the tutorial? No, we don't need to. Welcome to American Truck Simulator. At last, you have a chance to experience your dream job driving a truck. Your own transportation company is now open for business, but sadly, you lack the money to buy a truck. For now, you'll have to work for other companies as a driver for hire. Your task is to safely deliver a load of rice to Walbert Dock in Fresno. Your employer has provided you with a vehicle and will cover all expenses. Don't let anyone down. And arrive on time. 
All right, so we're delivering rice to Fresno for 300 and or however much that is. And this is our truck, Peterbilt. You can look back there. All right, we have a job now. F1 pauses the game. Oh, yes. Yeah, I need both mirrors. I will probably use the in-game mirrors, but uh, that all works for me. Oh, F3. Okay. Uh, F4 is nothing. F5 changes the map. So we are here. There is a garage there. We need to go down to here. F6 shows our cargo, rice, 43,000 uh, pounds. Current job, $1,500. Is that, is that how much money we have? Or no, job can come 235, okay. So we have $1,500. Remains five hours, seven minutes. Next rest stop in 13 hours, 58 minutes. Yeah, every 14 hours, it looks like we need to take a break. Um, this is the damage screen, and there are no short messages. All right, well, and at this point, I'm going to jump into the options. All right, I'll have to probably tweak the sounds levels as I go. Anyway, we have... So that's the cab, that is outside the cab, we have up over the cab, we have the hood, I think, yep, we have the lean out bumper on the wheel and the cinematic camera. All right. Let's get out of here. And... Five. All right, so we need to go that way. All right, so when is this job expected? Uh, remains five hours, four minutes. All right. So we're going to be good. And we need to take a right. some pedestrians and that's a recruitment agency all right we need to take a right to the highway and four miles or eight minutes remaining all right all right so we're going to need to go straight and actually what I'm going to want to do is Pay attention to the speed limit. All right, we are going to need to go left. Hold on just a moment. All right, I just wanted to rebind the left and right signals. go all right and right in here whoa 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 and where are we 
we going? Are we dropping this off anywhere in particular? I don't see... Unless I was supposed to stop at that indicator. <laughs> That's a possibility. Anyway. Um, press the following key to handle job delivery. What? Okay. Um, this is different. All right, tra trailer delivery. A skilled truck driver can deal with maneuvering in tight space when dropping off a trailer. However, cargo safety is a top priority. If you do not feel up to the challenge, negotiate with the dispatcher for a backup place to park the trailer. Um, sorry, I'm in a hurry now. Skip. You don't get any bonus experience. Let's play it safe. Where do you need it? So you get more experience if you choose a spot where you can just drive straight in. You know what? We're going to go with this. Oh, you can actually specify where it is going to go. Yeah, I'm going to go with that. Proceed to the unloading area. Head towards the red flag on your map. This is interesting. Didn't quite expect that. Oh dear. <laughs> uh, oh, seriously. <laughs> All right, well, this could be very interesting. It's been a while since I've backed up a trailer. Oh, this is not gonna work. <laughs> All right, I need to figure out how I want to get into this. Oh, whoa. Uh, I need to yeah, turn the trailer around. And now. Oh, no, no, no. Just want to back up the trailer straight. And then we are going to need to... Actually... All right, so we are almost there. So I want to, nope, not turn that direction. <laughs> All right, so I need to turn in this direction. Question is, how am I doing? Oh, 
Almost. Well. Alright, so... Actually, no, 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 I want, I need to back it up in, no, that's not going to work. All right. <laughs> I need to strain this thing out. Seriously, I will do it. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. Oh, no, no, no. I want to uh, come in like this. No, 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 no. All right, so I need to... Nope, nope, nope. This is not working. <laughs> Alright, let's try this again. Oh dear. Oh, no, 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 no. Where am I backing up to? No, I don't want to be on the ramp. No, 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 I need to, without, of course, trashing the trailer behind me. No, no, no. Almost. I'm closer. Now. I want 
to bring this around like that. Oh, this is All right. One of the annoying things about Euro Truck was the fact that these yards were made so incredibly tight that realistically it made no freaking sense. Although because I'm not a I'm not a trucker I really don't know how bad some of the cargo yards, oh, no, 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 could be in the world. No, I need to turn the wheels this way. Nope, no, 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 I, okay, I need to turn the wheels the other way. I will do it. Nope, nope. There we go, there we go. And now, I need to... Nope, 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 nope. All right, there we go. Cargo is ready for unloading. <laughs> Excellent! <laughs> uh, bonus for parking the trailer. Yes, 95 experience. <laughs> oh, 
Wow. I thought this episode might be short, like 15 minutes, if that. And uh, yeah, we're at looking at half an hour right now. So, of course, that's prior to editing. <laughs> Distance driven, 6 miles. Time taken, 57 minutes. Fuel consumed, 1.4 gallons. Base reward for 6 miles is $235, 5 experience. Bonus for parking the trailer is 90 experience. For a total of $235 and 95 experience. And I am level 0 newbie. Experience 95 of 200. Uh, love, I'm about halfway to level 1. <laughs> Anyway, let's uh, continue. And this is our truck headquarters. It's a pretty basic garage. It may not be much, but it's a start. Unfortunately, you haven't got anything to park there yet, so there are no trucks in sight. Once you've earned enough money and bought a truck, you will be able to move in the world freely and run your own business from here. Good luck. Well, with that said, Oh, I guess I don't have... I can't pick up a loan from the bank. I don't have access to skills. This is my progress history. One job. <laughs> anyway, we can go into Photo Studio. And yeah, the world map. We have Oakdale, Oakland, Santa Cruz, San Francisco, Stockton, Sacramento, San Rafael, Truckee, we have Redding, Eureka, Hornbrook, right on the border of, was this Oregon up there? Winnemucca, we have Jackpot right up there. Elko, Eli, or Eli, Tonopah, Carson City, Las Vegas, Barso, Prim, El Centro, and San Diego. Yep. Go from San Diego into Mexico, that would be nice. 395. Where is the Highway 80? Okay, yeah, Highway 80. I think it was Highway 80. Anyway, at this point, I'm definitely going to take a break here, and then we will continue off with more American Truck Simulator in the next episode. Anyway, thank you for joining me. Thank you for watching. My name is Scott for SP Gaming. And as always, have a good day.